Hello and welcome to Lace 8 with Jenny Brandis. In this video, we're going to look at the options, the default options set up in Lace 8 and how I personally will change them to suit myself. So let's click on Options, Preferences. Now we're looking at our preferences and I've changed a few things. I've changed the horizontal to 10 millimeters, which is one centimeter in from the left. And I've changed the vertical to 10 millimeters, which is one centimeter down from the top. That way I've got a little bit of play at the edge of the screen, or at the edge of my paper. I've turned off Keep Design Layers because I want my motifs when I paste them into my design to go on the layer that I'm on, not on the layer that I saved them from when they were put originally into the motif library. I've chosen to leave colour leaves printing them as white. It saves ink and it's not quite such a bold statement on the printing. And I'm going to have it show grid size on the page and to print the in that information at the top of the page. The exported dot size I've changed from 1 to 2. And I'm leaving check each time Lace 8 starts for the updates because I won't know if I don't have the checking on. I'm leaving the default directory or folder where they're putting my files as late 8 designs under documents so it's easy for me to find and now that I've looked at this I'm happy with what I've done I'm going to here and save and also save as default which means every time I open Lace 8 from now on this is going to be the standard settings. Preferences have now saved. If however you don't want to save and save as default at this point in time you can cancel and get out without any problem or you can just hit save which will save it for this file only. Now the next thing I also like to do is my default colours and widths. I don't like my gimps being orange, I find that too hard on the eyes when I print out on blue paper. So I'm changing my gimps to being red. Nice, bright, easy to find. They're unlikely to clash with the rose ground because you tend not to see gimps and rose grounds very close together. Now I want to save this as my default. And they are saved.